Hello, welcome back to Exploring the World of Coffee. Uh, today we are going to be doing another gear review and we are going to be looking at the Time More Black Mirror Scales. These are a great budget friendly option um, and I've had them for a good few months so I'm going to talk a little bit about how I found using them and why you might want to consider them too. If you're new to the channel I do lots of coffee content gear, uh, brewing, all sorts of different things. Um, so if this is something you're interested in, go check out my channel and I'd love it if you would hit the subscribe button so that you can see more of what I do. And if this video was helpful to you, please click the thumbs up and uh, let me know in the comments down below what you think. Okay, so if you haven't heard of Time More, they're a fairly new company um, in the coffee coffee scene and they basically make grinders and scales so far um, but the thing that i liked about them is everything's really budget friendly and a good price so that did initially make me a little bit hesitant i was like oh it's quite cheap for that product and um, i wonder how it's going to perform but after asking some of you on instagram for some scales recommendations um, there were lots in the couple of hundred pound price point and then there were a lot of you pointing out these so i thought for the money they cost drum roll please 54 pounds approximately at the moment i thought it'd be worth giving it a go and seeing how i get on with them so moving on to the features of these scales these are accurate to 0.1 of a gram they can take loads from 0.5 grams up to 2.1 kilograms so a nice range there. So the nice thing about these, I got fed up of batteries in scales, um, is that they are USB-C rechargeable and the battery life, they estimate about 10 hours on these. These scales do have a couple of different features built in. I tend to just use the standard feature um, where you press the button to start your timer um, and stop manually, but they do have different options where it will detect basically when you start pouring liquid and then it will start the timer for you um, and a few different options there. So have a look if you're interested in that, but I'm very old school and I just like to just do it all manually myself. Um, but yeah, they are there if you require them. Okay, let's talk a little bit about the quality of these scales. So number one, battery life is fantastic. I've had these probably about three, four months. And if I turn them on, ooh, I don't know if you can see that. The battery is still at three bars, basically, which is fully charged. So yes, I haven't been using them all day, you know, and I haven't left them on. But the point is that they've lasted this long and I haven't had to plug them into charge, which is amazing. And sometimes I've accidentally left them on um, and it just goes into like a sleep mode basically where I just turn the screen off. So I'm assuming that's to save battery life also when you're not using them, which is great. The build quality, they have quite a nice weight to them. Um, the body is like a plastic, which I think a lot of people were kind of disappointed in. Uh, but number one for the price point, you can't really complain and number two it's quite thick like heavy duty feeling plastic so i haven't got an issue with it at all and it makes it really nice to clean so if you spill something on it you can literally just wipe it down and it's done and then you've obviously got your removable rubber heat proof mat which is great and the scales themselves are actually waterproof as well the screen quality on these is fantastic i have no complaints at all uh, nice and clear to see really simple uh, I think you have options to turn the sound on and off as well. I like the beeps. I like knowing when I've pressed the button, so I have the sound on. And yeah, the overall design of them, they fit right in on my brew bar. Number one, they're black. Number two, they're clean and minimal, and they're not humongous. Um, yeah, they're just a really nice set of scales that just fit lovely on my brew bar. So what are my overall thoughts and opinions on these scales? I think they're a fantastic budget friendly option. If you're like me and you didn't want to spend a few hundred pounds um, on a set of scales, which no doubt are fantastic as well, um, but you know, you just don't have the money in your budget to spend that, these are a great option. And a lot of other scales at this kind of price point online, I noticed they either looked very cheap or like they just gave off that vibe of being quite cheap and just 
they they'd be fine but the design of them as well like played a part in it for me i wanted something that was going to look really nice in photos and look really nice on my brew bar as well as perform brilliantly as well and be reliable another key thing that i love about these scales is the fact they're rechargeable i don't have to keep going and buying batteries and I found that the scales with the batteries in, they didn't last as long either. Like I was constantly just replenishing the batteries in them. It was just a real pain. So I love that they're USB rechargeable, the battery life on them so far, I cannot fault it. It's fantastic. And I think the price is a very good price for a scale of this quality also. So in terms of what I use these for, I use them for pour over mainly. They do work for espresso. They do fit on the Gaggia Ruby, just on the drip tray. Um, I'll show you now, but uh, I've noticed like for like the Sage machines and stuff, they are quite bulky. And I think for a few other machines, they probably will be a bit of a pain to try and get on the drip tray to weigh stuff. So I would maybe look at one of the other options. They've got some espresso scales, which I'm actually eyeing up at the moment because I've got the flare at the moment and these do not fit under the flare <laughs> they do not fit in the little espresso scale compartment so they've got some small espresso scales which i think are around 80 pounds which also look fantastic um, so if i get them there'll be a review on these as well but for now these are fantastic pour over scales and luckily they fit on my espresso machine so i use those for both uh, but yeah just bear that in mind if you are looking for espresso scales just maybe look at the dimensions of these um, and check your espresso machine, like drip tray dimensions as well. As usual, I will link these below so that you can have a little look at them. All in all, a fantastic set of scales. And I would definitely recommend for the money, getting a set of these for your brew bar if you're looking to upgrade your trusty old scales that maybe you've had for years, but now it's time to get something a bit, bit more up to date. Um, these are brilliant. So I hope you found this review helpful. Um, it's just a little look into my user experience with them. Um, they're a great scale to use. And uh, yeah, let me know your thoughts, any comments down below in the comment section. And don't forget to click subscribe if you like my content and leave a little thumbs up if you found this video useful. Uh, I really hope it was. Uh, I know when I was looking for scales, I was uh, scouring the internet for lots of reviews and uh, it's always good to have more out there. So. Without further ado, I will see you in the next video, guys. Bye. I think I might have to scale down my excitement for filming this review. Ha <laughs> ha. I'll leave now.